Hey guys, we're here at Free Play Arlington and we're about to fight for the future. We're playing Street Fighter 3 Third Strike. After releasing what is still considered one of the best fighting games of all time, Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo, Capcom struggled to find its footing. Faced with declining revenues at most arcade venues and stiff competition from US fighting games like Mortal Kombat and 3D fighting games like Tekken, Capcom embarked on three new branches of the Street Fighter universe. 1. The poorly reviewed games based on the Street Fighter movie franchise with some being made by Capcom in-house and others being outsourced to incredible technologies for American audiences. 2. The better received and ultimately loved games in the Street Fighter Alpha series, all developed in-house by Capcom, but which still struggled to find an audience at American arcades. And 3. A maligned attempt to compete with the 3D fighters in the Street Fighter EX series, all programmed by third-party developers with Street Fighter licensed characters. With its key franchise quickly becoming diluted and generally dismissed, Capcom refocused its Street Fighter energies on two main projects. A combination of Street Fighter with its successful American Marvel fighting games, resulting in X-Men vs. Street Fighter, and second, the very first Street Fighter 3. A true sequel to Street Fighter 2, Street Fighter 3 New Generation made its debut to the arcades on the new CPS3 hardware in 1997. Pushing the limits of arcade technology, the CPS3 hardware was capable of true color generation and CD quality stereo sound, resulting in Street Fighter 3's memorable ultra-rich gameplay and incredibly deep music profile. A return to form, Street Fighter 3 controversially discarded the character roster from previous games, with only Ryu and Ken returning. Despite these changes, or perhaps because of them, Street Fighter 3 was well received in virtually all arcade markets and was quickly one of the top earners in the genre. In true Capcom fashion, within six months of the release of New Generation, Capcom would follow up New Generation with a bug fix edition dubbed Street Fighter 3 Second Impact Giant Attack. Second Impact also made mild balance adjustments to the gameplay, added two new characters, and marked the return of bonus rounds during a single player campaign. With the gameplay relatively balanced and the majority of the bugs eliminated, Second Impact enjoyed a solid year before Capcom would release the final Street Fighter 3 edition, Third Strike Fight for the Future. Released in 1999, Third Strike brought back the iconic Chun-Li, added even more characters, and finalized Street Fighter 3 as a balanced, beautiful, and deep fighting game. To this day, Third Strike is viewed as one of the best 2D fighters ever released and is the only Street Fighter 3 you'll see referenced in the competitive scene or at a popular arcade. Interested in discovering Third Strike? Come check out our quickly growing scene at Free Play Arlington and Free Play Richardson, where any day you might find the top players in the nation fighting for the future and enjoying one of the finest arcade fighting games in history.